Hello everybody, I decided to do something a little random and a little vlog style because I'm going to be moving and leaving Korea soon. I'm going to be leaving this bookshelf entirely behind. So I wanted to give you a glimpse of how I've set up my bookshelf for the past year, what's on it, and as I'm going I'm also going to be taking everything off. So my next few videos, probably some of the ones that go up before this, are going to be of a bare bookshelf. And this is why I'm packing. So we'll start at the top and work our way down. First I'll show you what's on and then I will go back and just sort of set it up and speed through as I clean it off and take everything away. So let's get started. So here we have my top shelf. Now I didn't buy this bookshelf, I inherited it so I didn't really have any choice in anything. On my bookshelf I have notebooks, my little kitty, this little thing of randomness. It's just like a lid to a box that I've stuffed hair things and jewelry and a little notebook and maybe some money. Ah, my American money in there. I've got a calendar of the K-pop group Infinite because they're adorable. Behind them I have hair bow, nail polish, nail polish remover, map of my city, tour book of Korea, just random paperwork, a Hangul Korean writing workbook, the workbook that I got when I went to my epic orientation, and behind that is a folder of all of my personal information and paperwork and stuff from Korea. Moving down. So here we start my actual bookshelf. I've got this organized in it's sort of split down the middle of fun books, and then I've got the middle section of K-pop CDs, and my little duo from Gundam Wing that one of my friends from college made me, and then school books. And I ah, might as well just go through them real fast. So here we have, starting with Chris Lee's Drifting House, Angela Carter's The Bloody Chamber, Brad Meltzer, The Inner Circle, Brad Meltzer, Dead Even. Down here we have Mortal Instruments, City of Bones, a random notebook, candle, face cream, Shiny's Odd CD, Vix LR, Beautiful Liar, Unique, EO EO, Monster X, second mini album, Rush. And then here's Duo, just sticking his head out. He used to be sitting over here, but he can't sit here without support. So he's just doing his own little thing. Over here we have a coloring book, my notebook where I practice writing Korean, a random notebook with story ideas, and school books, I have The Wide Sargasso Sea by Jean Rhys, Love in the Time of Cholera by Gabriel Garcia Marquez, The Stranger by Albert Camus, Beginning Theory Book, Voyage in the Dark by Jean Rhys, The Norton Book of Composition Studies, one that's not actually for school but was given to me by my former creative writing professor from undergraduate, which is Responding to Student Poems by someone bizarro. Nice. And this big boy down here, The Art of the Short Story, a compilation of short stories and randomness. Also, I've got sticky notes everywhere. This is a list of just things that I wanted to do. Um, a goodbye note from one of my coworkers who left, and a random reminder that my coworker Chanel has one of my books. So, pause to get this set back up so it stops falling over. Duo, help me! And that's it for shelf number two. Moving down to the final shelf, which also doubles as the corner of my desk, because stuff... I mean, there's more shelves underneath here, but that's just, like, schoolwork that I have to go through and random stuff that was left in the apartment. Nothing important. So down here I have uh, books that I've read, am reading, am reading for school, notebook, stuffed animal, planner, another uh, book with... A sketchbook where I write story ideas, my USB and my little USB charm buddy so that I don't lose that in my bag. And over here is a mass of stationary crap, my glasses case, colored pencils, my old planner from 2015, and this binder which has like papers and stuff in it from work. 
So that's it. That's what my bookshelf looks like. And now I'm gonna tear it apart. I forgot to lower the tripod. me cleaning and now I have a few dedicated stacks. We have these books which I'm going to take a picture of and post online to sell. If I do not sell them I will donate them to the used book area of the city. And I have these books which the same fate will befall them but I want to read them first. Down here I left this stack of things that I'm still using and still going to be using for the remainder of my time here. I have the stack of things that are going to be recycled because they can't really be given away, like my epic handbook. Um, I might see if someone wants the Korea tour book, but I doubt it because everybody has one. This stuffed animal, which will probably just sort of be taken to school and what have you. And then over here, I have the things that I'm going to be packing. All of my K-pop CDs these two stuffed animals, um, and the stuff that I've been doing with my novel and important paperwork, and my, like, creative, creative writing and, uh, practicing Korean. Here I have some stickies and clamps, a ruler, pens, highlighters, more stickies, eraser, binder, and notebook. And what I'm going to do is I have this old paper bag take to school stationary. So all of that, all of these things are going to go into this bag. I'm going to take it, I'm going to donate it to my office so that the teachers there have surplus of sticky notes and clamps, which we're always losing, pens, which are always dying, highlighters, which are always dying. This is stuff that's really important in our teacher's office. It's so useful and it's gonna get used there and it's not gonna get used here. So there you have the new layout of my bookshelf and what it looked like before. It will continue to slowly be cut apart as I get ready to move. I now have, what, one, two and a half weeks? Yeah, I have two and a half weeks left here. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was really random. I'm sorry if my glasses are like glary or what have you. I usually film without them because I'm nearsighted and I can see within the vicinity of my filming area without them and therefore I just eliminate the glare problem. I need to get contacts probably. Whatever. So that's all I have for you today. Hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time. Goodbye!